Explain the experiment. All right, so the experiment that uh, our grade 12 chemistry class was doing today was uh, we're burning different types of foods and trying to figure out how many calories are in those foods and then we're going to compare it to the, the actual package on, the, on each of the foods. So we had um, some like cheesies and chips and Doritos and stuff like that. And so what we do is that we're essentially burning the food and then uh, that uh, energy that it gives off uh, is going to get transferred into the can of water and then we're going to measure the, the change in temperature of the water and then we can correlate those two um, so that uh, we know how much the, the temperature of the water went up that correlates to a certain amount of energy uh, which we use in the equation uh, Q equals MC delta T uh, Q being the amount of energy M being the mass of the water C meaning uh, how much energy that uh, particular substance in this case water absorbs and uh, delta T meaning the change in temperature and you plug all those numbers in you get your Q value and that's going to tell you how much uh, energy uh, each food actually um, uh, gave off and then uh, we divide uh, that energy divided by how much grams there are per food and that gives us our energy per grams and then when we do that we can compare that to the, the food labels and we can see how close we are and it's a very crude it's, it's there's a lot of sources of error but uh, uh, at least it gives you a kind of general idea on how we come up with uh, calories in foods. Thank you.